nagpaisa ang National Arts Month nitong Pebrero at hindi naman nagpahuli ang Angeles City dahil nagtipon-tipon ang ating mga tanyag na local artist upang makibahagi sa okasyong ito. Artists of all disciplines mixed, matched, and joined forces as Angeles City proudly celebrated the National Arts Month in February pursuant to Presidential Proclamation No. 683 issued in 1991. This year, the National Commission for Culture and Arts celebrated with the theme Tradition and Innovation. Angeles City adopted the local theme MANA, which means Legacy. In alignment with tourism goals of helping promote local arts and culture, the Angeles City Tourism Office and Kulyat Foundation Incorporated hosted this event in cooperation with Angeleno artists Ronnie Tayag and Minerva Arceo who helped coordinate for their fellow artists at Pampanga Arts Guild. Acto supported Tayag who came in as independent artist in his advocacy to revive arts and culture and share the opportunity with artists from all disciplines. The objective of this event was to encourage local artists to sustain their craft and eventually establish a regular source of livelihood. The two-day celebration and exhibit was highlighted by a series of exciting activities which happened on February 11 and 12, 2012 at the historic Amintuan Mansion and Museo Ning Angeles. Featured here were sculptures and paintings of artists from Aguman Sulat Kapampangan, Art Association of the Philippines, Pampanga Arts Guild, and Pampanga's independent artists. Many of the works, which will be on display until the end of February, are available for sale. Buyers can inquire directly to the artists whose contact details are displayed alongside their artworks. Lectures and forums on art trends, bringing the past and the future. At Museo Ning Angeles, bonsai and horticultural exhibits by the Kapampangan Horticulture and Bonsai Society awaited. There were also booths for Kapampangan Arts and Crafts, Culinary Art, Green Art, and the works of Pampanga Tattoo Artist Club. Local artists and architecture students were also featured at Museo Ning Angeles. Activities include street art at the Museo Park, plus perspective drawing at the Heritage District by architecture students. A graffiti wall was made to encourage visitors to express what they like about Angeles City to highlight the city's official brand slogan, Angeles City, I Like. The celebration closed with a Kabampangan serenade by OK Musica or Original Kabampangan Music Culture Arts Advocacy, inspiring Kabampangan Poesia and a colorful entertainment finale by the Sinopuan Performing Arts. The National Arts Month celebration in Angeles City has something for every art enthusiast and supporter. Let's embark on a unique adventure in the arts for free and discover many things to like about Angeles City. Naging matagumpay ang Philippine International Hot Air Balloon Fiesta 2012 dito sa Clark Freeport Zone sa Pampanga. Nagkaroon din ng booth ang Angeles City sa tulong ng City Tourism Office ng Lungsod. Panoorin po natin ang highlights ng Hot Air Balloon Fiesta dito sa Pampanga. The most anticipated events probably in the whole province if not for the whole country. Different races from different countries gather for this one-of-a-kind experience that lasts for four days every year. This is the Philippine International Hot Air Balloon Fiesta. This year, 
A hundred thousand people were expected to see this special event which is regularly being held at the Clark Freeport Zone in the province of Pampanga. Aside from the 28 colorful hot air balloons, there is more that meets the eye on this famous fiesta. Well, this year we have uh, American U.S. Air Forces coming, we have Indonesian, we had Brunei, we have the most skydiving uh, activities, we will also have tandem skydiving, we have all new um, uh, special shaped hot air balloons. As you can see, the exhibits are bigger, uh, the, the displays are more interesting, we have more airplanes and more flying. So definitely uh, different from the previous years. This is the 17th year of the fiesta, which started in the early 90s, where Mayor Ed Pamintuan also happened to be the mayor of Angeles City. Uh, it was February 1993 when uh, the uh, intrepid uh, pilot Joy Roa started this and the uh, CDC president then, uh, General David, supported him. And I, as the mayor of the city, definitely nagkakandra pa ako no, na tumulong dahil sabi ko, this is a chance that uh, the, the Filipino people will have a second look of uh, Pampanga and Clark. The, the landscape was different uh, then and uh, compared to now. That it was a sea of desolation uh, during those times. And uh, now if you're going to uh, uh, ride the balloon and see if, uh, uh, from up, makikita mo, there is now uh, uh, economic uh, development. The landscape had changed totally from a gray to green. This spectacular event will help you give some of the highlights of this year's Philippine International Hot Air Balloon Fiesta in Clark, Pampanga.
At kagaya po nang napanood ninyo mga lumilipad sa Hot Air Balloon Fiesta, sabay-sabay rin po tayong lilipad mga Angelenos sa pag-asenso dito sa Angeles City. Basta't lagi nating tatandaan kung tayo'y magsasama-sama at magtutulungan, agyuta mo. Ito po ang inyong likod, J. Pelayo IV.